When God puts favor upon your life, it is a tangible way that God begins to do things in your life that show forth His approval upon your life. It doesn't mean that God loves you more when God begins to favor your life, but the favor of God is just an indication that you're living in a way that pleases God, so there's a favor upon you. That is, God begins to do things for you that otherwise you would not be in a position to experience in life, and I will tell you that with the favor of God, God can do amazing things in your life that you could never, ever accomplish on your own by His favor. It doesn't mean He loves you more. It just simply means that you're living and walking in His favor. If you are a parent here today with multiple children, you understand that you love all of your children equally, right? You don't love one of your kids more than another kid. You love them all the same. However, if one of those children come to you and say, Hi, Dad, I just want to find out what you want me to do, and I sure want to be obedient to you, and would you please help me and guide me in my life, and I just want to be the best person I can be, even though... And you have another one that says, I'm just going to be as rebellious as I can possibly be toward you. Do you still love them the same? There's no difference in love. But which one gets the favor? Come on, be honest here, okay? The one that's walking in obedience, right? The one that's walking in a, in a sense of connectedness with you. The one that says, I'm leaning in to find out how I can be the best son or daughter I can possibly be. And so, again, it's not a matter of love. It's a matter of getting in position so God can favor you. And the Bible says that when you and I make the decision to be overcomers, God says, I love somebody with a spirit like that. 